Howdy there, guys. Uh, welcome to Call Crawl Studios. Thanks for uh, having some time with me. Uh, tonight, we're going to start a new segment called Mailbox Someday. And that's like, you know, someday your stuff's going to show up. So when I get a bunch of mail, which I've been getting mail piling up because I started, had a different project going on. Wasn't really RC car related. It was actually uh, this trailer project I built for a gal who turned it into a flower card for her. But uh, anyways, that'll be ripping through the background. Uh, tonight, I am super excited because I got a bunch of these. Uh, the Vanquish did a super good sale on Trucks of Fortune. And so basically, it is a mystery box. And the uh, what's cool about it is uh, the mystery box actually has the mystery machine color motif that we all know uh most of us know the ones who don't know about scooby-doo well you gotta go find out uh anyway so what we're gonna do tonight is i'm going to weigh each one of these boxes and then we're gonna uh, mark them and open them up and kind of see you know maybe you can weigh your box before you open it just to make more anticipation so i'm super excited to get started on this so um Anyways, let me get set up and I'll be right back. Thanks. Hey, thanks for uh, staying in here with me. Uh, got my scale all set up. Uh, I did have it facing you guys, but you can't see it from there anyway. So my recording equipment is like, you know, bare bones. But whatever. We're going to have fun with this. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and uh, turn the scale on here. It's a G4 scale. Uh, I've had it for about three four years. I put a piece of plywood on top here. Um, and we're zeroing out table, a little bit of table movement. Let's weigh the first one. It's kind of weighted. This one's weighted like stuff sliding around in there, and the weight's off to one side. Uh, let's see here. We've got 100 and 187, 187.5 is what this one is. So 187.5, divided by 16, 11.718 uh, pounds. All right, so we're going to go ahead and break that right on here. 11.7, we'll round up to 11.72. All right, let's do another one. Um, zero. Okay, we got zeros everywhere. This one's like got stuff on both sides of it. So we'll put it on like this. Ooh, 198.5. 198.5 divided by 16. Woo, 12.406. So we'll call it 12.41. <clears throat> 12.41. All right, box number three. Zero this guy out. Thanks for hanging in there with me. Uh, that's the big reveal. Uh, I took a lot of time to build that flower cart. Do a little pull out tray in here. Um, okay, this is zeroed up. Let's get on to the next one. Trucks of Freedom. No, not Trucks of Freedom. For Trucks of Fortune. Uh, this one's also well centered balance. So I'm gonna lay it on this way. Feels heavier. Um, no, we got an error, error, error. One corner is too heavy. Let's uh, zero that one more time. So I never really participated in the Vanquish um, big programs like they have, like they've been doing. Um, gosh darn it, error on that one side again. Let's try and measure it this way. One ninety three point nine. One ninety three point nine. You guys already got that on your calculator. One ninety three point nine divided by sixteen. Twelve point eleven pounds. All right, not all that different than this one. Twelve point eleven pounds. We got a couple of 12 pounders and then we got one that's uh, 11.7. 2.1 pounds. 
Two more to go. Believe it or not, I did five of these. They let you do up to ten. Um, so that's a bunch of money. So I did five. And we'll see how we do. As most of you guys are probably participating in this, uh, you're all hoping for the same thing I'm hoping for, mostly. And that is those 199.8. 199.8 one 99.8 um, the ultra or the pro that'd be really cool this box got damaged I mean, you can see it here it looks like it got ripped open I don't know if things were murfed out of inside there uh, but you know that's unfortunate we'll find out it's not been opened uh, just damaged so anyways uh, that's Box number four. Oh, let's just put one up there and hope they don't fall and hurt themselves or me. Last one. Uh, zero out the scale. Super exciting, I know. Probably going, okay, yeah. Uh, some guys tell you to go get your favorite, you know what, and come back and see them. And I'm okay with that. Uh, oh, we got an error on the left front tire. Let's try and do the do it this way. Oh, that's got it all. 198.4. 198.4. 4. 198.4 divided by 16 equals 12.4 pounds. So that one I didn't change. 12.4 pounds. 12.4. All right, uh, 12.41, 12.11, what was that one up there? 199.8 divided by 16. That was 12.48. 12.48. 12.48. Well, oh, that's the open one. So the open one was the heaviest. This was 12.4. Let's just double check this one. We're going to open the heaviest box first and work our way to the lightest. So the lightest right now being the one on the bottom. It's got a lot of slop in there. There's a bunch of stuff sliding around. So maybe it's the holy grail, right? Okay, one more time on this one. Oh, we got an error. Oh, it's asking for zeroing. So, anyway, yeah, I'm super excited about this segment. Um, I've got mail piling up like crazy, so hopefully I'll be able to knock out a few of these videos for you guys, and um, you'll get something out of them. I know I'll get something out of them because I'm opening up my mail. <laughs> so, uh, all right, here we go. One more time. Come on, baby. 198... 198.6 198.6 divided by 16 equals 12.4125 so we're gonna call it 1241 so I got two boxes that are 1241s that's interesting okay so you're gonna have to wait all right stay tuned I'll be right back I'm just gonna clear the table and get ready to open up boxes thank you and we'll, okay, guys, we're we're back here at Call to Crawl, and I am about ready to open up these uh, trucks of fortune. Again, this is the heaviest one of the bunch. We're gonna start with that one, but boy, there's a big hole in there. I could just fit my hand in there and pull stuff out right now. What did I get? Let's open it all the way up. I am definitely not a Vanquish expert. Um, probably just off uh, Virgin. It would be my. Uh, category in Vanquish. Uh, so let's see, we got a rear F10 aluminum portal rear housing. Uh, no cover, no nothing, just a, just a rear housing, just uh, the way it comes. Uh, with of course the inflated price tag of $139.99. Uh, uh, I got the little nifty Vanquish Trucks of Fortune plaque memorabilia. Uh, we all need that. And then it looks like I've got a front one of those F10 portals which I currently don't own um, actually I do own that's right I have a Phoenix over here 
Uh, you probably can't see because it's off camera, but uh, it was the first gen Phoenix that came out. I ordered two of them, sold one to a guy, and then uh, that one got put together and then got stopped because I needed my welding bench built, which is now built. You'll get to see that in the future of your videos. Uh, and I got a Vanquish motor plate for the, um, and it's black. So there you go for uh, VPS 10148. I don't know what that fits. Um, you guys are the experts out there, not me. All right, let's open up the box. I really dig the, I really dig the, um, the tape. The, the motif on the tape, tape is just uh, outstanding. Vanquish is making some big moves these days, and you know, like I said, I'm a newbie as far to Vanquish, um, not to RC car modeling. I started my RC car career back in 1982-3 when I bought the Frog and uh, that was an amazing car sitting up there on the shelf uh, and then I bought another one so it looks like this box I've got the Phoenix Portal which I already currently own that one uh, this one is the Falcon Edition so it's kind of unique in its own way. Um, it may sit on the, sh sit on the shelf, excuse me. Um, and uh, Jimmy packed this one. Thank you, Jimmy. Appreciate you, man. Appreciate the work you did here. Um, you know, I'm sure it wasn't your fault that the box didn't make it here in one piece. And this was the heaviest one. So heaviest is not always the best. But uh, yeah, we'll make do. I'm excited. I think that's got the machine gears and some other special goodies in it. Uh, so anyway, there's one big box. This this box kind of got hammered though. Um, anyway, let's get on to another one. And I'm back, 12.41 uh, pounds. Let's see what's in this bad boy. This one made it pretty well. It just had a little tiny thing on the top. This is about, this opened like Christmas. It is kind of that time of year, isn't it? Winter's setting in. I don't know where you're at, but we're up here in the Pacific Northwest, and uh, it's starting to get chilly at night. Oh, we got a Ford Ice. All right. Never had one of those. Heard they're pretty good. And we got a lot of weight here. Uh, looks like we've got black straight axles. Um... Oh, these are the are these the new HD. Oh, I think they are. We're gonna have to get into that. Oh, a first tray. Super cool. All right, so uh, the four dice. Uh, if you haven't seen one, this is what the four dice looks like. I'm gonna end up with a lot of boxes. I probably should have thought about that before I started recording. Anyway, uh, that's fun. So yeah, the four dice here. Uh, a couple of guys like uh, ran a bunch of miles and ran for massive hours and they're super durable. Um, I'm not going to do like any unboxing stuff here, of course, tonight because that would just make things be way, way too long. Uh, but super excited. Now, uh, let's see, which color did I get? Does it say? Uh, looks like it's the gray one. Okay, cool. I think it's the gray one. Yeah. All right. Super. Next. Oh, somebody else does that. I won't steal the shtick. It's a great shtick, by the way. All right. Continuing on with mailbox someday. Someday your stuff will come in. Apparently mine did. Well, this is a nice package. Uh, yeah, this is the uh, Curry HD44 VS410 uh, blacked out with the red covers. Straight axles, that's pretty sweet. Pretty dang sick. What else are we get in there? Oh my goodness. We got some wheel weights. There's two of them. You know, going on the front. Ooh, got a couple of drive lines. I love those drive lines. Uh, got a parts tray. That's pretty cool. A little rubber parts tray. That's, you can never go wrong with those. Probably take that home. Uh, currently building a track at my house. Slot cars and 1.4 scale crawler course. Got me a green uh, Trucks of Fortune sticker, or a little card there. So I green, green one, black one, and then in here, 
is a VS410 Phoenix uh, light kit. Sweet! That's very cool. Uh, that's for the Phoenix, so and I already got a Phoenix, so that's pretty awesome. So let's move on. This is all super cool. Real weights. Oh boy. Uh, oh, I forgot to see who sent me this one. The first one was from Jimmy. The second one The second one is a phantom. Well, you know what, Phantom? I think I got a better deal on that one than Jimmy sent, so. Heck yeah, go Phantom! All right, let's move on. Let's get another box, 12.41. We're getting lighter. Woo -hoo -hoo. You wanna see it before me? I have to look away. I have to look away, I have to look away. I can't see it. Uh, I hope it's not upside down for you, but there it is. What'd I get? What'd I get? I can't hear you. I'm gonna have to look. Oh! It's a Phoenix Falcon Edition. And I got a little goodie bag here. Ooh, okay, all right. So we got the Phoenix Falcon Edition. So that's too, a little guy. I'm gonna put this right over here. Be right back. Uh, sorry for all that uh, rigmarole. Uh, another phantom. So far, Jimmy at least signed his name. Pride in your work. Good job, Jimmy. All right, moving on. Let me get in the space. Let's take a look at that real quick. Okay. Oh, we've got the uh, clear F10 aluminum portal front housing, clear. And clear for the rear. And another motor plate in black. And another black fortune tag. I'm so fortunate to have these fortune tags. Okay, moving on. Another 12.41. Come on, Ultra. Right? You're all wanting to see an Ultra. I know you are. Oh, uh, come on. How many do I have to buy? Can you imagine? No Ultras? I'd have to order five more. So they're letting you order up to ten. I know, that's crazy, right? Well, it looks like we got the four dice. Again. Okay. Let's see here. Four dice, ready to run, RTR. It's going to be a good Christmas around here for somebody. Uh, I'll, leave, I'll leave it in the box. Um, I think. Ooh. Oh, ooh, look at that. That says Wheels of Fortune in a black bag that you can't see. And they can't see when they packed it. I love that. I, you know, they made it fun. It's really a unique, who else does this? Uh, well, I guess RC Four Wheel Drive does it. And you get a bunch of pins that don't always work or mostly don't work or something. Okay, another box. I'm gonna get a full one here. And this one is signed by the Phantom. They have more Phantom workers than they do real people at Vanquish. There's more Phantoms there. It's probably one of their machines, their new machines now. One of those five access things. Whatever those are, I don't know. Anyway, it's done at four dice. Um, yep. Let's see, what color is this one? It, does it say on the box? Blue. It's blue. And that other one was gray. And then we got the Falcons. And we're down to our last box. Woo. Oh man, it's like having just a few poker chips left. And you really, really are waiting for that hand to show up. It's going to, like, really take it home. But then you have that feeling, like, mm, is it really going to happen? 
So what do we get for wheels? Ooh, those are pretty. Uh, I got some nice bead locks. Set of four of those. Uh, set of four are probably like, I think those are the 225s. They're not very big. Um, and then we've got, I think these are machetes. I'm just starting to learn my wheels, uh, which also have beadlock rings in them. Yep, these are the machetes, uh, 1.9 in black, version 2. Yeah, alright, well those are good looking wheels. Uh, I don't have anything that's going to go on just at the moment, but you know, I like buying stuff. I have a hard time selling it. Does anybody else have that problem? I mean, uh, is it a thing? Anyway, uh, last box. Here we go. The lightest one of the group. Coming in at 11.72 pounds. The last box. Man, come on. Let's see what we get, baby. But don't get me wrong. I have some rare RCs. I've got a new inbox to me, a Hilux. And the bubble wrap. Our blister packs are still in pretty fine shape, if I use it for myself. The uh, exterior box is in pretty nice shape. Oh! Well, it's not an ultra, but it's a pro. Yes! Yes! The lightest box, and it's a pro. So sick! Ah, okay, that is fantastic. Got a nice pro kit. Oh, there's some goodies in here too. Oh man, yeah. VS410 Pro, and it is clear. So we got clear axles. That's the uh, that's this color. They call that clear. Uh, what do we got in here? Oh, we got some grease, uh, and we got another black. Uh, black card there, and ooh, wow! I got a set of wheels too for this bad boy. Ooh, this is a good score. Let's see if they sign their name. Is it Jimmy? Ah, oh, it's a machine. Ah, oh, Jimmy. You know what? My hat's off to you. If I had a hat on, I'd take it off. All right, good job, Jimmy. I'm excited. I got a pro. Uh, I've been talking to a lot of friends of mine and. They open them up, they order one or maybe even two, and they open them up, they get the RTR, and you know, the, because these guys are not going to be around for a very long time, um, you know, people want them. So, anyways, I'm excited. I've got one. It's clear. I got a Black Pro at home, unopened box. Um, should I roll the dice for five more? Let me know what you think in the comments below. Let's open up this last bag, huh? Let's see what these wheels are. Maybe it's that new blue. That'd be pretty sick. Ooh, I do love these. These are really cool wheels. Uh, I got a bunch coming in for a mail call uh, someday here coming up whenever it comes in. Uh, these are the tanks. 1.9 clear tanks. And I do love, the, the tanks are just cool. I love big spoky wheels. You know, I'm old school, so I kind of like the older style wheels. What else is in this bag? We got hubs, and we got some rings. Same rings as uh, this set right here. And we got uh, two sets of those guys. So anyways, there's my haul. I hope you guys like the video. Um, like, subscribe, share, or don't, you know. I could still end up being the most unpopular RC channel. Uh, call to crawl. We'll see you next time on Mail Call someday.